Europe saw yet more dramatic farmer protests on Monday. Demonstrators in Belgium dumped tyres in the capital and set them alight. The road leading from the EU district to central Brussels was also clogged by columns of tractors. All this was just a short distance from where EU agricultural ministers were due to meet Monday to discuss how to respond to farmers' demands. Ministers are due to debate a new set of proposals to ease the pressure on the sector. It includes a reduction in farm inspections and the possibility of exempting small farms from some environmental standards. Protests have taken place for weeks in a number of EU member states, including France, Germany, Spain, Greece and more. Poland also saw action over the weekend. Farmers there used tractors to block a key crossing into Germany, sparking traffic chaos. Europe's farmers have a variety of demands. They argue they're struggling with rising costs and taxes, tough environmental rules and competition from cheap food imports. That's a lot of hay. It's like a battle of the... Dude. <laughs> Dude, I mean, and what did it help? The police is still standing there. Good job. Come on, you're in a tractor. Why are you backing up? He's gonna go for it. Oh, yeah, he's just absolutely ripping it. Whoa! Yeah, did you see that? <laughs> and now they're just gonna put it back. <laughs> I think, yeah, no, he actually. Yes, 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 come on. Because she's gonna spray the water. No, 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 now they're backing up, now they're backing up. 
Now that the water tank is, I mean. Is the water tank that bad? I mean, for a person, yes. For a tractor, I have no yeah, idea. Yeah. <laughs> I look, it's already squirting a little bit. Like, oh, he's, he's already all excited. Look, he's pretty excited. He wants to just. Also, I didn't ask you. Oh. Uh, yeah, I am. And I think that's tear gas.